Hello everybody, Jet here, and a welcome to a new Total War Warhammer 2 playthrough, uh, quite obviously modded, where today we are going to be playing as Toddy, uh, Boris Toddbringer, uh, with the uh, Mixus faction on Locker, and we're also using the Southern Realms uh, Dogs of War mod, so Mercenary Camps Dogs of War mods, which basically gives me access to all of the troops you can get through the Southern Realms. Um, sorry, I just whacked my ear. <laughs> uh, but no, it gives you access to all the troops you can recruit through the Southern Realms through the Dogs of War, through the Mercenary Camp mechanic. Same as the Ogre mechanic, but it will pop up as I'm fighting. I've not tested it out yet, so it may not work with the, uh, with the, uh, Mixus mod, but I suspect no. it will, so. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into our first battle versus Leopold here and the uh, Carrion Burgers down here, who or Caro Burgers down here, who have succeeded from Middenland for us. So uh, we need to deal with them nice and early on. Uh, other things we do get as Toddy is we get some nice buffs. Uh, Beastmen naturally have fear of us, and uh, because Toddy has a lot of history with them. And we also get plus 10% physical well. resistance to all state troops, which is insane. So that's going to be fun. Anyway, I need to fight this because it's my first battle and we always fight our first battle. So Leohold Bugelhoff is going to get his butt kicked and be brought back and his troops will be brought back into the fold. It's not their fault they are being led by a secessionist. And of course, we are going to prove that we are the true heir of Sigma, uh, because, well, while Franzi's got his place, he is obviously young, callow, and inexperienced compared to, compared to a veteran like Toddy. Oh, why aren't you setting up like I want? Let's move forwards to that ridge line. That's that's pistol pistolers, so that's not too worrying. You guys can come in and pester them from the flanks. Ready for war. Go to battle. The Empire endures. Pistoliers. Crossbows ready, General. Take the ground. No, hit them, please. The ground quakes. There we go. So we're already doing significant damage to them. These guys are on skirmish and they can shoot and move, which is perfect. Hit those swordsmen as they charge up the hill towards me. Let's get Toddy down to assist. Ah, no, they're rejigging their formation already. Not quite sure what they're doing, but their charge got messed up there. And they've been broken around our, our line, which is good. The brave Midlanders will hold the scum. We've got the high ground, so obviously... Sorry. We've got the high ground, so they are obviously going to struggle. Oh, Toddy, get on him. Toddy can take Leopold. Leopard off himself. Let's start moving these guys forwards. You can move there. You guys can slam into that flank. And you guys can start shooting into there. Let's not let those pistol ears get in at all. I want them on there. And we're enveloping them here, so they are going to crumble. 
Okay, that is good. They're surrounded. Toddy is having his fun. They are getting broken again. Nice volley in here, and that should do it. I almost feel bad for them. Almost. Secessionist scum! And they flee. As they would. I don't actually necessarily want to kill the Lord, because he'll be replaced. But there we go. Hardly anything lost on our side. My pistol is... My pistol is did very, very well. Uh, Toddy got 18 kills, which is good, but he got himself, got himself a bit more blooded. All my units got a bit blooded, which is good. Gives them some experience, which is the main thing we're after at this point. Uh, we will take on captives because it's not their fault they are led by secessionist scum. Step to it! To strengthen the Empire. Uh, Root Marcher first, always. Obviously, we will get him a Griffin long run because Griffins are cool. I hold there he is. I'm, I'm happy to stay friends with Thranzi for the moment. I will prove my le superior leadership through... Um, yes? Welcome through diplomatic country. effort. All right. Oops. Rather than war. Right. Well, I've given myself a couple of extra wars to fight there. Oops. All right. Surely an agreement will be reached. Marienburg so, is ripe for the plucking, to be fair, so I probably don't want to. And they're so not an the empire faction. No. So they no. are somewhere I can legitimately expand into. Obviously, we've got the Black Pit and stuff around here what? as well. Attack! Mm. I'm going to give this a go. This could be... They're, they're quite powerful, actually. Um... I am not playing on hard hard, so it doesn't necessarily make this the easiest early game. Um, I need to push fast, basically. For the Emperor! By Sigma, obey me! Spearman! By Ulrich's wrath! That's not... Spearman! Uh, I hate it when it does that. Spearman! March! My pistol is going to be one of my main things to deal with these guys as best as we can. They've all spawned up there. God damn it, this is going to cause us problems. This isn't... I'm not sure I can win this, if I'm honest. There's just too many of them. Straight across the other side of the map, where I can actually get in behind a bit more. I should have fallen back. For the Warhammer! Break up! Detachment formations! Hmm. Because the real danger here is they can just envelop me. Soldiers of the Empire. I'm pushing these guys we forwards because they are shielded, so they will do better in the initial push. Glory to the Empire! Forwards! 
Forbidden land to the Empire. For skull splitter. And apparently for skull splitter. For the war hammer. For the comet ready. The Empire ensures. Yes, sir. Yes, General. Oh, that was an annoyingly powerful hit. Down. To it. Swordsman. Spearman. For the war hammer. Moving now. Okay, that's good. That's good. You're on skirmish mode, you should fall back. Swordsman. Taking position. Oops. Right, I need you guys on there. You guys hold. We're going to get overwhelmed here. This is the real danger. I need these guys around the rear. Take the ground. Formation march! Avoiding combat! Oh, straight into them! By your command! Missile troops! Get ah, no, not a can hells. I'm not winning this. Damn! I just don't have enough troops to uh, defeat them. There's too many of them for me to... They, they just overwhelm me. Um, which is why I saved beforehand. I, it is a bit safe, Scummy, and I do apologise for that. But I didn't have a chance to practice run on this. So I'm actually quite happy to uh, save Scummy at least a little bit. I mean, Toddy's not taken any damage yet. His leadership is going a little low, but he's not taking any damage yet. He's going to break, though, because everybody else is breaking around him. God damn it, Toddy! Don't do it! Don't do it! He's going back up again. Hey, you never know. He might win this all on his own. Fighting bravely. Surrounded by the secessionist scum. I'm intrigued as to where he thinks the stronger enemies are. The danger is actually is when we kill these guys because they'll start shooting at me. Bugger, 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 bugger. That's what I was worried about. It's actually getting it when the range stuff hits me is the problem. Bugger. If I can, I'm going to fall back without uh, safe scumming because, yeah. But we shall see if we can, basically. Uh, let me know, by the way, in my comments if it's too loud when I'm doing the zoom-ins, if I need to lower my desktop audio a little bit more. The nation calls. By Sigma's right. It's fine. We can fall back. We can rebuild. No, growth. Hmm. How should we proceed? Oh yeah, and my legendary hero here. Thorn Thunheim. I should start moving him down in. They'll be marching, all right. So he is a captain, though he's something special. Uh, extra growth and public order first. I know military buffs might be nice, but growth and public order are key to actually increasing my standing long run and building myself up. Oh wow, they are already gone. Oh. 
Bugger. I cannot afford to lose here. Um, it's going to be a tricky one. I should be able to win this. But we're going to have to be, be careful. We're going to lose units as well. Ready. By Ulrich's wrath. Bugger me. Again, the Huntsmaster General is going to be problematic to deal with. Oh, hang on. Moving now. By Ulrich's wrath. And I'm quite happy to let Toddy take the brunt of the fire from these guys. I want Toddy to take that central unit on his own. And these guys are going to go flanking those other units. And if Toddy can drag them all in, that's perfect. Oh, perfect. That is actually perfect. The way they're hitting us there is really good. Nice. I'm kind of ignoring their range, which is risky, but... Right, support on this flank where you're shooting right into the rear, please. Toddy, you need to bloody shine. Come on, Toddy! Again, the real threat is the ranged attacks from people around us, but they don't have as many. Kill them! Kill them all! Toddy wins this. He will have saved my butt. The Empire I'm not sure I deserve that victory. I overextended and they made me pay for it in blood. Um, so Karaberg is going to keep hold of there for the time being, but... We will deal with them long run. Bernhard van Hessel is going to get his butt kicked eventually. Again, I'm going to take on troops because it's not their fault they've got bad leaders. The Empire, by Sigma's right. Your orders, drill. Praise Sigma. Yes, my lord. I do. I don't have state troops yet. Ah, monster pens. Monster pens. I'm assuming this is how... Ah, this is the Dogs of War camp. Okay. It's just obviously the mod. So these are things I can get through the Dogs of War mechanic, which is quite cool. I see I don't have access to any of them yet. Inspiring presence. What? Yes, archers. Normal archers, please. I need more. 
And two turns, we will be substantially better off, built up, and potentially able to push again. And Middenheim will, Middenland will become Ascendant. Ooh, I don't want to lose the prestige, I don't want to lose that. Slandered, you have been caught with vicious rumours. Exposed for slander, I will spend the money. I've got plenty of cash at the moment still, so... The Empire. There we go. I'm obviously going to have to deal with the Black Pit sometime soon as well, but Karaburg really needs to be brought into the fold first thing. What does the Emperor bid? Yes? This will bolster the nation! One more turn and then we're going to march. A uh, size of force of 18 should be enough. We've got plenty of shielded guys there. I'm lacking anti-large, but we've got plenty of archers in there as well. Ready. While bog standard archers aren't as good, they will still do. It is for the best. Uh... No. I will marshal the men. Alric's will! I'll see. They may... Hmm. I'm going to auto it because if I auto it, everybody is guaranteed to die. It's a bit silly, On march. but it guarantees there's nobody so. left. To the so while that was potentially not the best way of doing it, it guarantees I could take the town. Yep, buffing my range to start with. I always like buffing my range early. Actually, I should probably be pushing down this route to get lightning strike. Nice. There we go, and let's be honest, it's not difficult for me to replenish now. And we've reclaimed Karaburg. And we are going to go for Grofval region, and we're going to move up, and we are going to push the Black Pit next. And then we're going to get our get our house in order, and potentially look at pushing Marienburg. The Brayherd comes, not in my territory, thankfully. Yes, my lord. Let's build Middenheim up a bit more. That is very nice, and it's much more growth than just the normal building, so yeah. We're going to get this. Uh, reduces recruitment for some units, that's not really what an issue just now. Did? Grab grain silos and let's see if anybody else will trade Sigma's with me yet. Will. The Empire. I will listen, but my hmm. time is short. We cannot. Auckland. I mean, I don't blame them for not liking me, but one of the benefits of the way the Empire works at the moment is they can't really just go. To, I mean, they can just go to war with me, but they will probably invoke the, the wrath of the entire Empire. So. Ah! Uh, Stirland has been attacked it. Uh, send a military force. Uh, it'll cost us money, but that's fine. Now, I honestly can't be asked fighting the battle, because it has no impact on me if they win or lose. I mean, it might long run, but... I will marshal the men. Let us move! We're getting a hell of a lot of chaos corruption here. Show me the accused. Looking ahead. Huh. Creeping corruption. Uh, I don't know how long that's going to last for. That is a bit annoying, but not much I can do about it. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's enough. I actually need... Some guys with pointy sticks. 
and then we're going to march towards the black pit to try and deal with that. I don't mind the elves there. So long as they leave me alone, I will leave them alone. Because it's horrible territory for me. And it's somebody I can trade with, to be fair. Not since the coming of Morga has Athel Lauren been so tame. Certainly not. Let's send them a gift. I will do my duty. There we go. Praise Sigma. What does the Emperor bid? I want to be a bit careful. They are relatively powerful, actually. The nation calls. At the moment, they're relatively powerful. So I just want to be a little careful with going up against them. Not that worried about taking the black pit, but I don't need to be silly. Okay, so we have a battle, guys, and this is going to be a battle for us to fight next time. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys, but it's perfect time to cut to cut this one. I hope you are enjoying this playthrough. If you are, obviously, please do like and subscribe, guys. Um, as always, an extra special thank you to all of my channel members and patrons who should be on screen now. That's our Monsters Abound, Unnamed, Space Ace 475, and Coding Monster. With an extra special thank you to William Farmer for helping to support the channel, guys. Um, other than that, as always, thank you to everybody who has watched, liked, subscribed, commented, shared, anything like that. You are all awesome, and thank you very much for watching. Cheers, guys.